Hey guys, what's up? My name is Jalea Christine and I am a Pixie Cup partner. So today in this video, I want to share a little bit about my experience with the Pixie Cup and tell you guys a little bit about who I am. So like I said before, my name is Jalea Christine. I am an influencer uh, and many other things, but most importantly, I am a woman of God. My first time trying the Pixie Cup was in February 2021, and it was quite the learning experience. I had gotten all my supplies and Pixie Cup had sent me all of my stuff. I was so excited. And the very first time I used it, I actually tried to do it without looking at any of the instructions because somehow I thought that I would magically get it, but that did not occur. Word of wisdom, read the directions first. So after I realized that I couldn't get it with just swinging it, I looked at the directions and I looked at all of the resources that we have here at Pixie Co. And I felt so relieved. I felt so relieved after I looked at all of the blog posts and got more information on the website and realized that the struggles that I was having with my Pixie Cup wasn't the first time that it happened and that there were answers and solutions to the problems I was having. So I was very accustomed to using tampons before I used my Pixie Cup. So I think my first time using tampons was in middle school and I was a cheerleader and I just thought of tampons as the more sportier, better option um, versus like wearing pads. I just decided I wanted to use tampons one day and I took it upon myself to use tampons and ever since then I had been using them and so trying this Pixie Cup was such a new thing to me. So compared to the Pixie Cup, tampons are different in size, they're different in shape, and they're different in regards to disposal. And so after realizing like tampons are so much different, I'm so used to them, I realized that I needed to give my body time to adjust to this new thing I was trying out. Word of wisdom, if you're a beginner, be patient with your body and give your body time to adjust to this new thing you're trying. So throughout February and March, I tried multiple times trying to insert the Pixie Cup and get it right. And I didn't get it until this one weekend I went to the beach with my sister. And I was so determined to get my Pixie Cup because I was like, I'm at the beach, it's the perfect time to use a cup instead of a tampon. And I finally got it. I was so excited. I was like, oh my gosh, I got it. I'm a pro now. But <laughs> this moment though was not that miraculous. Every single time that I had previously tried inserting the Pixie Cup and I didn't quite get it, I would learn something out of that experience of practice. And so every time I practiced, I was learning something and discovering something new about my body. And so when I finally got it that time in April, it was the combination of all the things I learned and the things I discovered and put together. And I finally used that to master the art of inserting um, a Pixie Cup, allowing it to pop open and to remove it. Another thing that I learned in my experience with the Pixie Cup is that even though I may have gotten it once with inserting it and allowing it to pop open and removing it, didn't mean I wouldn't struggle again in the future. Actually, after that first day that I got it, a couple days later, I was having some trouble taking it out and I was just like, why am I struggling? I got it before, I can do it again. But using a Pixie Cup is all about practice, practice, practice. Practice makes progression not perfect. So as long as you're practicing with your Pixie Cup and trying out new things or trying out new folds, don't get discouraged. I want to encourage any woman out there that is trying to thrive with her Pixie Cup and get it to pop open and to enjoy it. Don't give up on your experience because every time you try it, you're learning a new skill or learning how to adjust to the next time you do it. So eventually all of that will come together and you'll be able to get it just how you like it. All right, guys, so that's about it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope it brought some value to your life or to your experience with the Pixie Cup. And I'll see you guys in the next one.